Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. This is Rich Mencio with Onet. Today we're going to break down the uh, release of Larry Bird. All right, here we go. Let's jump into it. Okay, um, the finger spread is, is, is it, it's different. Um, the index and the middle finger are close together, but something that, uh, that he has uh, gotten accustomed to and uh, made adjustments for. So we'll break it down frame by frame and show you the adjustments that he, that he made. And again, I'm just talking about the release, the hand. I'm not talking about where the, the ball is, um, elbow, anything of that nature, just, just the release. Okay, now do you see how it started? Keeping an eye on the ring finger. Now, do you see how far it is to the outside of the ball? Now watch the adjustment that he makes to get the hand center under the ball. If he wouldn't make any adjustment, that, that, that ball would come, it would, it would come off pretty much the way it's sitting now. It would come off so that he, he wouldn't be able to keep it straight. That ball would end up going to the left of the rim. But the, watch the adjustment he makes. And again, it's a small adjustment that he'll make in his wrist and pushing, pushing right there with his index He'll push with the index, straighten the wrist out, turning the wrist. Now look where the ring finger is. Now it's become more centered under the ball. Now he can, now he can do an even push with the index and the ring finger, pushing the ball towards midline, middle finger. Right there, and then four a little more. Right there. Okay. So now if we see the index and the ring finger are leaving the ball. That's pretty close to simultaneous. Puts the ball right there on the pretty close to the center of his middle finger, which makes it a very good shot. Forward it. There it is, right there. Boom, right off the middle finger. Wrist, again, breaks down nice and straight. There's no side movement to the wrist. All right, let's go on to, let's go to another clip. Again. The same. Smooth breakdown of the wrist. Applying the even pressure, trying to leave simultaneously, putting the weight on the, of the ball on the middle finger. Look at that. Look at the adjustment. That's a nice adjustment. You see how it ends up? It ends up. Now his ring finger and middle finger end up closer together because he just makes he makes that, that minute adjustment to put the ball on midline of the middle finger. Right there. Puts a nice backspin on it. And the rest is the rest is history. Alright. Thank you guys for tuning in. Catch you on the next NBA player. Have a great day.